And he got down and he hit it right into the heart of that middle pocket to set up his first real opportunity at the table. Steen de Sterk, our first opportunity to really see him in action. Let's see what he can do on a snooker table. red just above the black spot got a little bit lucky there with position because the red ball the, the collision with the red ball has meant that the cue ball would run further up the table I think it wouldn't have been on a colour really had he not played that shot it's a thin snick then to take this blue to the middle very very nicely played cannoned into the pink to develop that little cluster of reds as well so it's a real opportunity now for the Sturk to get a frame on the board and I'd be delighted if he could get it in one visit as well a choice of two reds here now one to the left middle and one to sorry right left corner and one to the right corner after he's played this black black will go back on its spot nicely played moves the break onto 20 and you get to see some of the arena unfortunately first day many people working so the auditorium only about a quarter full but a fantastic setup it is Steen moves that break on to 28 now just left himself hampered there on this red to corner but he's managed to keep control of the cue ball and he stayed on the black that cue ball back I think put a bit more distance on that cue ball than he probably would have liked but he's still got this red to the same corner pocket it's been a good opening break here from Steen de Sterk of Belgium he's overrun that one massively he's going to take some kind of recovery shot here luckily that l little kiss on the yellow has meant that there's a possibility that he can keep this break alive now he's going to need the long rest now he can stretch over Cue ball's going to go three cushions to finish on the red just above the black. That's what he's looking for. Flirting with the middle pocket there. He's not played that well at all. I'd have played that there with top right to send it round the angles and finish on that red above the black. But he's going to have to recover massively now if he wants to keep this break going. Corner. Be a bit of a tough ask, but he's played it very, very well indeed, and he's landed on the black as well. He's delighted with the way he's played that. He's managed to keep this break alive. And he can just run this black in, send the cue ball off the, the top cushion, play for the red above the black here. And he's trying to screw it round off two cushions. I don't know why he's played that shot at all there, really. Just need to stun it off the bottom cushion. He's still going to try and take this red on. But it's a tough ask. And what a shame. The break ends at 47. But it does give him a 39 point lead then. Over Sean Murphy. 